So today I'm going to share with you my summer essentials. This is a collab video with Not A Rich Girl, also known as Tammy. So after you're done watching my video, then go ahead and click below and check out her video and subscribe. And to all you subscribers that are coming from her channel, welcome. I hope you guys stick around and let's get into this. So the first thing that I have been loving this summer is Bright Lips. And I have to tell you that I have two that I am always wearing. I switch up in between the two. Um, the one that I'm wearing on my lips now is called Fiori and is from Stila. And you can find this at Sephora, Ulta, those kind of places. And it's just this nice bright, bright, bright pink. And I love this color. It stays on for a very long time. It does not remove from your lips unless you eat something. Besides that, it does not budge and it is amazing. It can be a little bit drying if you apply too many layers of it, but besides that, I give it two thumbs up. The next thing that I have been loving is another bright lipstick and this is from Milani. This is more on an affordable kind of price. The other one is $22, this one is around $3 to $6 and this you can find in any drugstore. Also find Milani products that are like half off or even at CVS and Walgreens. So here is the lipstick right here. This one is called Flamingo Pose. I have talked about this lipstick plenty, plenty times. So there it is right there. As you can see, it's not as bright as the Fiori one but it is definitely a bright lippy. It is amazing, uh, very moisturizing, and it does last for a good amount of time. What I like about this one is that you can apply it, pat it out, and leave it more as a lip stain instead of having the full color for the lipstick. It's very moisturizing and it does um, its job. It's amazing. The next lipstick that I love, that I haven't worn that much, but I'm gonna start wearing, is this pink lipstick right here. It's more on a purple pink. And this one is from the Wet n Wild Fergie, and this is called VI Pink, VIP Pink. So it's right there. As you can see, it's more in a purple tone than a pink tone. But I like this if you want to wear something that's a little less bam and a little more toned down, but you don't want a nude. This is what I'd like to go for. So I love that color. The next thing I want to talk about is nails. Um, I have been obsessed with this specific polish. This is Julie G's um, Gelato in Venice. And I actually have it on my nails right now, which I need to fix. And these, um, the little dots is what I use uh, with this color right here. If you follow me on Instagram, I'll put my Instagram name right here. You'll be able to have checked out that picture or when you follow me, you can see it from there. So this is the nail polish that I love. Julie G polishes can be found at jessiegirl.com or at Rite Aid. And they're like $4, so they're amazing. I love her polishes. The next thing is an eyeshadow that I have been obsessed with. This is Stila's um, Kitten Eyeshadow. In the summer, I am not that big of wearing eyeshadow. I am more of just putting in one color eyeshadow and maybe a bronzer or a face powder and putting that in the crease and just calling it a day um, for the eyes. But I actually have been loving the Stila Eyeshadow and this is in the One Kitten. This is one of those eyeshadows where it's perfect to use all over the face, all over the eyes, all over in the, in the corners and the brow bone as your highlight on your face, which is what I have been using. So it's one of those multi-purpose eyeshadows. It's a really, really pretty color. While I'm talking about it, I wanted to show you. I mention this all the time, and it's one of those bought it but forgot it kind of things. Like You always go back to it every once in a while because you forget you have it. So there it is right there. I love this eyeshadow and this is also from Stila. The next thing that I am like loving that I cannot live without during the summer, um, this bronzer, just like any bronzer but this one I have been loving. I mentioned it in my June favorites. This one is in the color Antigua and there's the color right there. It's a really dark brown. It's perfect for my skin tone. There it is right there. It's really buildable and it does last all day and I like to apply this to my face because in the summer, I do not wear foundation. I will sometimes wear just concealer and um, face powder, and or I will just wear BB. The two BB creams that I have been using is the Pond's BB cream, which I have mentioned plenty times. It is in the color color medium, and the next one is from Jouer, and I actually received this for Valentine's Day, and this is their Luminous Moisture Tint SPF 20 Oil Free, and it's just a little sample size, and I absolutely have been obsessing with this. I'm using it right now, I have been wearing it, and it is in the color Glow. 
I believe that it does give a little bit of coverage. It's not heavy at all. It is for me, even though it says oil free, I don't know if it's a combination of the other products that I'm using. It does leave my skin a little bit oily, at least by around the T-zone area, just very little. But once you blot it out, you're good to go. But I actually love this and it is buildable. I've been obsessed with that. The next thing is lip scrub. When you are, you know, applying all these different bright lip colors and they're, you know, ones that are liquid lipsticks, you are going to need to exfoliate your lips. So my favorite lip scrub right here is from Posh and it smells like marshmallow and it's amazing. So lip scrub is definitely an essential for the summer. The next thing is blushes. Gotta have one that's stay. This is one that I have loved ever since I got it a really long time ago. This is a Maybelline Dream Bounty blush and this is in the color Peach Satin. And it's one of those favorites that I use only in the summer and springtime because it is one of those products that will stay. So it's right there. It's just a really, 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 really nice and natural color that it will stay on your cheeks for a good amount of time. And this you can also find at drugstores, I think. I don't know if they sell them anymore, but if they do, then you are definitely, you definitely should try it. So the next one that I love that I know they do sell is Benefits Blush in Hervana. This one I love for an everyday kind of color. You can swirl the colors together, just take a few. I love this actual um, blush right here. You have seen me in one of my previous empties videos, I actually finished one. So I have this backup and I love this for everyday use. The next thing is bright eyeliner. You know, you always wanna go ahead and at least have one bright eyeliner. So this one is from Chella and it's a navy blue. I like to wear this when I'm going to have a natural lip and I just want a pop of color, just want something different. I go with this eyeliner, I love it, it's perfect. And it stays on for a really, really long time, even in the water it does. So the next things are for body and hair. So the first thing is a suave dry shampoo when you are having when you have your hair straight during the summer you definitely want to make sure you get all the oils out of your hair so dry shampoo is the way to go next thing is lotion this one has been my favorite it's called endless weekend not going to get into too much detail because i mentioned in my new favorites but Jeff, definitely any lotion that will moisturize the skin before and after the pool and beach is uh good with me next two things are Scents. The first one I have in, is an exotic coconut body splash from Bath & Body Works. Absolutely love this for after the pool or after the beach or even after a nice shower. It has a nice coconut scent to it without it being too overpowering. And when I'm actually going out, I like to use this Haiku um, perfume. Except this is not the same one I always mention. This is the Sunset one. They came out with Haiku Sunset and it has a nice um, daytime kind of scent to it. It's very, very, very good. I love it. It stays on for a long time. Mm, I just love it. So it can be a little bit too powerful if you apply too much, but compared to the other one, I pretty, you know, I can say that they're neck and neck, like they are that good. So the next thing I wanted to mention are some favorite songs, because during the summer you're gonna need some music, whether you're at the beach or at the pool, or you're just at home in the backyard getting a tan reading a book. So some songs that I have been loving are the Justin Bieber song, Where Are You Now? And of course, I've been loving Outside by Ellie Golding, I believe it is. Selena, Selena Gomez's new stuff is good. So just that kind of music, anything that's upbeat and you know, something that you can sing to, those are the music that, I, that is the music that I'm into. So those are all my summer essentials. I hope you all enjoy the video. Please go ahead and check out Tammy's video down below and check out her channel, subscribe to her if you want to, and I'll see you guys in the next video.